right, welcome back to the channel, everybody. We are on season seven of Game of Thrones, episode one. So, last episode, Cersei blew up the everybody that she hated in King's Landing, basically. So, Marjorie's dead. Her uncle's dead. He had the kids kill the Grand Maester. Mm -hmm. And... And Tom and jumped Tom off and the roof. committed. I mean, off the roof. He, he tried to fly. I don't think he tried. He knew he couldn't fly. He just yeah. So he landed in King's Landing. Uh, and Cersei has been Cersei named is the now queen. queen of the Seven Kingdoms. Jamie came back and was like, "What the heck's going on?" Oh, um, John is king in the north. Yep. Baelish is up there trying to do his sneaky underhanded stuff and turn Sansa against him. And Daenerys is on the ships. Daenerys the is on water, the ship. On her way to a destination. Heading towards, presumably, Westeros. And Arya killed Walter Frey. <laughs> but still, nothing does compare to my Battle of the Bastards. Nothing can bury the Ramsey yeah. down. What, six, episode nine? Yeah. Season six, episode nine. Nothing. So we're going to see what these last two seasons and have to hand out. Sam is in Old Town at the Citadel. And Amazed about all in the In love books. with the library. Yeah. Amazed at all the books. So you're down. you got two seasons to go. Are you, I'm sorry. Are you... Are you are you happy you're almost done or? <laughs> yeah, I'm happy I'm almost done. I'm anxious to, to see what. Anxious to see how it ends. Anxious to see how it ends. Hmm. Oh, and the cousin did. The war is over. Winter has come. And Bran saw that John is not Ned in the vision. Yeah. Euron returned home after a long absence, murdered our father, and took the salt throne from Yara. Cold winds are rising in the north. We need good men to help us. You can still help a lot more than you've harmed Clegane. It's not too late for you. And that's the world's greatest library. I'll learn about things that will help when... when they come. Are you sure you're ready for this? I'm the three-eyed raven now. I have to be ready for this. I want us both to go home, but they took it from us. How do we go home? You're in the great game now, mm. and the great game is terrifying. My name is Arya Stark. I want you to know that. He tried to run. Woo. I'll get you like you got my mother. Mm -mm. Oh, they didn't do the intro this time either. <laughs> Him. He did. Oh, was it a dream? You're wondering why I brought you all here. I've gathered every fray who means a damn thing so I can tell you my plans for this great house now that winter has come. But first, a toast. This is the finest arbor gold. Proper wine for proper heroes. <laughs> hmm. Stand together. Stand together. Hmm. Not you. I'm not wasting good wine on a damn woman. <laughs> I'm not the most pleasant man. I'll admit it. But I'm proud of you lot. You're my family. The men who helped me slaughter the Starks at <laughs> the Red Wedding. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Butcher the woman pregnant with her babe. Cut the throat of a mother of five. Slaughtered your guests after inviting them into your home. <laughs> That's Arya, bitch. 
You should have ripped them all out, root and stem. <laughs> Leave one wolf alive, and the sheep are never safe. That's Arya. She got two minutes, but now she know how to do it. Hmm. When people ask you what happened here, <laughs> tell them the North remembers. <clears throat> the North remembers. Winter came for House Frey. Don't <laughs> yeah, mess with Arya. She just took out the whole family. Pretty easily. The whole seemed like the whole yeah, the whole family. Bye. She tall like him? I mean like I would be like, Ugh. No, she ain't tall like him. Apparently, like when you put the face on, you take the physical character features oh. too. Don't ask me how it works. It's all magic, I guess. Wow. But yeah. <laughs> I'm like, that's Arya. Dragon. Dragonstone. That's new. Well, we've seen it before. That's where Stannis was when he, after he got. Well, the twins? Well, that's where they were just at. The, the river? The twins is where Walter Frey was. Oh, okay. But Dragonstone is where Stannis was based out of. Oh, okay. Where he had Davos locked up in the dungeon. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. The North remembers the winter is here. <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, Lord. What's this? The people, the night walkers. Mm -hmm. I can't see. <laughs> this storm coming, winter storm. Hmm. That kind of sucks. Yeah. Oh, he's got John, dead John too, huh? Mm -hmm. so one of them died at the witch car when they came and attacked that. Well, they, I they think they burned all them bodies. Oh, he's got two. He got three of them. Mm -hmm. oh, so he's just watching them. Are we a castle block now? You wildlings. I'm Mira Reed, daughter of Howland Reed. This is Brandon Stark, son of Ned Stark. Bring him here. Now do I know that's true? Well, he ain't walking, is he? I mean, come on, man. We're at the Fist of the First Men. You were at Hardhome. You've seen the Army of the Dead. You've seen the Night King. He's coming for us. For all of us. You still don't tell me who you are. <laughs> I know you know the stories. Died. Now that girl can carry that boy, and you telling me y'all can um it takes two of y'all pull him in. Mm. It was easier with two. Oh. I want every northern maester to scour their records for any mention of dragon glass. We need to find it, we need to mine it, we need to make weapons from it. Everyone. Age 10 to 60. We'll drill oh, she bad. with spears, pikes, bow and arrow. It's about time we taught these boys of summer how to fight. <laughs> Not just the boys. You expect me to put a spear in my granddaughter's hand? I don't plan on knitting by the fire while men fight for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, man, I'm impressed for her. That's what I'm talking about. Man, woman, boy and girl on Bear Island. <laughs> <laughs> While we're preparing for attack, we need to shore up our defenses. She balls it. Oh, I yeah. like her. Like her. 
said is the wall, and the wall hasn't been properly manned in centuries. I'm not the king of the free folk. But if we're going to survive this winter together... Yeah. You want us to man the castles for you? Aye. Last time we saw the Night King was at Hardholm. The closest castle to Hardholm is Eastwatch by the sea. And that's where I'll go. Looks like we're the Night's Watch now. <laughs> They breach the wall. The first two castles in their path are Last Hearth and Carhole. Well, the Ambers on the Carstarks betrayed the North. Their castles should be torn down with not a stone left standing. The Umbers and the Carstarks have fought beside the Starks for centuries. They've kept faith for generation after generation. And then they broke faith. Yeah. These families of their ancestral homes because of the crimes of a few reckless sons. So there's no punishment for treason. Yeah. I'm gonna need you to shut your mouth. The punishment for treason is death. Small John Umber died on the field of battle. Harold Carstark died on the field of battle. They died fighting for Ramsay. Give the castles to the families of the men who died fighting for you. Hmm. Well, she right about that. Yeah. My father always said, the man who passes the sentence should swing the sword, and I have tried to live by those words. But I will not punish a son for his father's sins. And I will not take a family home away from a family it has belonged to for centuries. That is my decision. And my decision is fine. Mm. You better shut your mouth, girl. Shut your mouth. Mm. Alice Carstark. <laughs> she, they like afraid is he gonna kill us? I ask you to pledge your loyalty once again to House Stark, to serve as our bannerman. What the kids gonna do? They ain't got no other choice but to do. I know, right? Yesterday's wars don't matter anymore. Will you stand beside me, Ned and Alice, now and always? Now and always. Look at her. Yeah, she can't be like questioning. He, he the did the he did the seed seed growing there. Mm -hmm. That's all he had to do is plant a seed. Yeah. When you question my decisions in front of the other lords and ladies, you undermine me. We can't question your decisions. Anymore. Of course you can. But Joffrey never let anyone question his authority. You think he was a good king? Girl, shut your mouth. Do you think I'm Joffrey? See her power going to her head, and she ain't even had it that long. Yeah, for real. <laughs> You're good at this, you know. At what? At ruling. You suck at it. They respect you, they really do, but you have to... <laughs> Why are you laughing? What did Father used to say? Everything before the word but is horse shit. <laughs> he never wanted us to see how dirty the world really is, but... Father couldn't protect me, neither <laughs> can you. Stop trying. Alright, I'll stop trying to protect you, and you stop trying to undermine I'm me. I'm not trying to undermine you. You have to be smarter than father. You need to be smarter than Rob. I loved them, I missed them, but they made stupid mistakes and they both lost their heads for it. And how should I be smarter? By listening to you. Mm. Would that be so terrible? The Raven from King's Landing, your grace. Mm -hmm. Cersei of House Lannister, first of her name, Queen of the Andals and the First Men, protector of the Seven Kingdoms. What does she want? Come to King's Landing, bend the knee, or suffer the fate of all traitors. Mm. You've been so consumed with the enemy to the north, you've forgotten about the one to the south. There's a thousand miles between us and Cersei. If you're her enemy, she'll never stop until she's destroyed you. Mm. Everyone who's ever crossed her, she's found a way to murder. Mm. Yeah. You almost sound as if you admire her. I learned a great deal from her. What is this? It's what we've been waiting for our whole lives. It's ours now, we just have to take it. You've been quiet since you came home. Are you angry with me? No. Yes. Yeah. You afraid of me? Should I be? Yeah. <laughs> Daenerys Targaryen has chosen Tyrion to be her hand. Right now they're sailing across the narrow sea. Our little brother. The one you love so much. The one you set free. 
Yeah, shut up. Now he stands beside our enemies and gives them counsel. He's out there somewhere at the head of an armada. With some dragons here for <laughs> better recognize. Enemies to the east. Enemies to the south. And Arya Sand and her brood of bitches. Enemies mm. to the west. Olen, the old cunt. Another traitor. The old cunt. She got her cunt. Yeah. This bastard has been named king in the north and that murdering whore Sansa stands beside him. Enemies everywhere. We're surrounded by traitors. You're in command of the Lannister army now. How do we proceed? Winter's here. We can't win a war if we can't feed our men and our horses. I'm the queen of the Seven Kingdoms. Three Who cares? Kingdoms are best. Three. That's right. Three. Three. It's danger we're in. I understand we're in a war for survival. I understand whoever loses dies. I understand whoever wins could launch a dynasty that lasts a thousand years. A dynasty for whom? Our children are dead. All of them. We're the last of us. A dynasty for us, then. We never talked about Tommen. Your fault. It's her fault. Killed himself. He betrayed me. He betrayed us both. He betrayed. Well, I loved them. I did. But the ashes now. We're still flesh and blood. Oh, so you really don't care that your son did, because you think of him as betraying you? Yeah. That ain't sleep, really. Does. Can't survive without allies. Where are our allies now? Hmm. They. Because Frey is dead. Useless old coward, but the Frey supported us. Now they're all dead. Whoever killed them is no friend of ours. We need allies. Ha <laughs> ha! Arya the Stark. The Stark's coming for you. Y'all should never kill Ned Stark. Learn nothing. I can't wait till they kill her. I mean, she just gets worse and worse. Mm hmm. This is Dragonstone, huh? No, that's King's Landing. That's King's Landing? Yeah. To the Greyjoys to King's Landing. I invited Euron Greyjoy, the new king of the Iron Islands. Well, dang on. Hey, the boats got, them ships got built pretty quick, huh? I know, right? Shoot, it was just two episodes ago. Right. Timelines are weird on the last few seasons. They have, like, time machines where to go. Move real fast and see it. You're on Greyjoy didn't come here for that. No, but did he come here for that? To marry her, probably. What the hell was black man? Yeah. And since it appears that all our treasonous family members are fighting for the same side, I thought we rightful monarchs could murder them together. Hmm. You're not a rightful monarch, though, are you? Now get your little ugly tail on down. Weren't you the one who started that rebellion by sailing to Casterly Rock and burning the Lannister fleet? Mm. You certainly caught us there. Very smart move on your part. Of course, we all made it to the Iron Islands anyway. When you rushed through the breach and started cutting people down, it was glorious. Like a dance. The people I was cutting down were your own kin. Place was getting crowded. Hmm. He made for her. Look, he made for her, yeah, he, he, he crazy too. If you hadn't crushed us, I wouldn't have gone into exile. And if I hadn't done that, I wouldn't be the greatest captain of the 14 seas. With the Iron Fleet, you own the seas. So y'all just really completely forget that the girl got dragons? <laughs> hmm. Ever since I was a little boy. I wanted to grow up and marry the most beautiful woman in the world. But you do. Here I am. Look, you do. Thousand ships and two good hands. <laughs> I decline your proposal. Why? You're not trustworthy. You've broken promises to allies before and murdered them at the nearest opportunity. You murdered your own brother. Mm. You should try it. it feels wonderful. Mm. I don't expect you to trust me outright. You need proof of my honest intentions. In my experience, the surest way to a woman's heart is with a gift. A priceless gift. I won't return to King's Landing until I have that for you. 
I don't like him. That should she should have let the mountain cut him down where he stood. Mm -hmm. Oh heck, ah, oh. I empty y'all bed pants. Really? Oh. Ugh. Oh my God! That she wish she said he would never want to be there, huh? Yeah, you know, that's part of our job too, you know. Hmm. That's part of your job. Oh, nurses empty bed pants. Mm, yeah. Mm -mm. I was like, mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> 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 mm, yeah, running water. I don't know, but that food that they eat look like doo doo that they eat. There's why I got such loose bowel movements. <laughs> mm -mm. Sam and his weak stomach. <laughs> <laughs> I don't blame because I'd be the same way too. Restricted section of Harry Potter. A triumph of transitory pleasures. Our tops, they are ready, huh? Yeah. Archmaster, I was wondering. What's the weight? Um, 147. I was wondering if you'd considered my proposition. I don't remember your proposition. <laughs> I asked you if, in light of what I'd seen in the North, if I could have access to the restricted area of the library. That area is reserved for maesters. Are you a maester? No. Not a very strong proposition, is it? Archmaester, with respect, I've seen them. The army of the dead. The White Walkers. I was sent here to learn how to defeat them. But everyone in the Citadel, those who will even talk to me, they all doubt the Walkers ever existed in the first place. Everyone in the Citadel doubts everything. It's their job. But the tales of the long night can't be pure fabrication. And the simplest explanation for your grating obsession with the White Walkers is that you're telling the truth. So, you believe me? I do. That makes you the only person south of the Twins who does. In the Citadel, we lead different lives for different reasons. We are this world's memory, Samuel Tarly. Be a good lad. Clean this up. Be a good lad. Well, I'm gonna clean up the body. Right. Guess you gotta do what you gotta do to get to where you wanna be. Yeah, you gotta start at the bottom sometimes and work your way up. Oh, or you can just steal the keys and <laughs> be sneaky about it. <laughs> He risks getting thrown out, don't he? All right. He's got a purpose. Oh, oh he's gonna steal the butt. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh Lord. <laughs> You're a lucky man. <laughs> I've heard she beat the hound in single combat. She's a very impressive woman. What do you want, Lord Baelish? I want you to be happy. Mm. You're getting a you getting a mind. You can get out of my face, I'll you're be right. happy. Like, you're becoming a stalker now. <laughs> Look, no. Grand's like, leave me alone. What about happy? Why aren't you happy? What do you want that you do not have? 
At the moment, peace and quiet. No need to seize the last word, Lord Baelish. I'll assume it was something clever. <laughs> <laughs> you done with this shit. <laughs> Why is he still here? Really? We need his men. Without the veil, Ramsay Bolton would still hold this castle. Littlefinger saved us. But he wants something. Yes, he do. I know exactly what he wants. Down from Am I singing? For real? Or is this music? <laughs> Treasure. She was his shame and his place. Mm -hmm. I got a good voice. It's Ed Sheeran. Huh? That's Ed Sheeran. Who's Ed Sheeran? He's a singer. What? Hands of gold are always cold, but a woman's hands are cold. Oh. <laughs> Never heard it before. It's a new one. Isn't that Lannister's man? Yeah. I don't want to steal your food. And you're not stealing, we're offering. Come on, it's going to be a cold night. You're heading south. King's Landing. Worst place in the world. King's Landing? Yeah. There's been some trouble with the phrase up at the twins, so we're part of the army that's been sent to keep the peace. Guess first. Oh, no, I couldn't. You don't have enough. But my mother always told me to be kind to strangers. Strangers to be kind to you. But hey, a nice group. You're a long way from home. I'm sure you've had some adventures, though. <sighs> yeah, endless adventures. When we left home, we couldn't wait to get away. But now we've been gone a while, we can't wait to get home. My wife's just had our first baby. Boy or girl? Oh, who knows? You think soldiers get ravens with news from home? <laughs> <laughs> I hope it's a girl. Why? Girls take care of their papas when their papas grow old. Boys just go off to fight in someone else's wars. Mm -hmm. It is so true. So why is a nice girl on our own heading to King's Landing? I'm going to kill the queen. <laughs> Why you say that girl <laughs> among them? Why you say that among them, girl? <laughs> she said, but I'm, she, she I'm, like, I'm for real, y'all. Bad night to be outdoors. You've got real powerful magic to figure that out. Did the Lord of Light whisper that in your ear? <laughs> <laughs> You want some rum? Don't like that shit, it's too sweet. Rum sweet? This seems like a good place to spend the night. These people don't want us here. Seems deserted to me. No livestock, no smoke coming from the chimney. I hope these are the people he knocked that man off his horse for the little girl. That their stuff, their gold or silver. I don't like the look of it. For a big hard man, you scare easy. I'll tell you what doesn't scare me. Bald cocksuckers like you. <laughs> you think you're fooling anyone with that top knot? That <laughs> 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 top knot. See if there's a ladder. They always leave something behind. There ain't nobody in there. What happened to him? Be some years, huh? For you wow. to be all skeleton like that. I can tell you one thing, this this war lasted what 10, 12 years or something. Lasted a while. How do you think it ended for them? I'd say they were starving. And rather than let his little girl suffer, he ended it for both of them. Mm. Doesn't matter now. No. Doesn't matter now. Because he took that silk. Let's just eat you alive, Hal. I've known you a long time, Dundarin. And I always thought you were dull as dirt. <laughs> you're not bad. I don't hate you. Don't like you. But you're not bad. <laughs> that warms the heart. So why does the Lord of Light keep bringing you back? <laughs> you think I don't ask myself that? Every hour of every day. Why am I here? <laughs> you like Ian? What you eat? 
I don't understand, our lord. Your lord. I don't know what he wants from me. I only know that he wants me alive. If he's so all-powerful, why doesn't he just tell you what the fuck he wants? <laughs> Again, come over here. Don't worry, the fire won't bite. <laughs> In luck, I end up with a band of fire worshippers. <laughs> <laughs> Almost seems like divine justice. There's no divine justice, you dumb cunt. If there was, you'd be dead. And that Maybe. girl would be alive. I can see where he's where he's coming from. What do you want? Look into the flames. I don't want to look in the damn flames. <laughs> I keep asking and no one wants to tell me. <laughs> we can't tell you. Only the fire can tell you. What do you see? Logs burning. What do you see? We're gonna get to see something this time. I'm just there. Ice. A wall of ice. The wall. What else? It's where the wall meets the sea. There's a mountain. Looks like an arrowhead. The dead are marching past. Hmm. Thousands of them. Wow. Do you believe me now, Clegane? Do you believe we're here for a reason? I want what? You about to go be leaving or something? Or are you burying them people? Then you know. What the hell are you doing, Clegane? <sighs> Burying the dead. Oh, that's nice. Oh, yeah, since it's his fault they're dead. I knew these people. Not really. <sighs> well, that's nice of him. You know, the hound, he getting get better, huh? Yeah. I guess Stan with Arya. Made, yeah. made him a human, huh? And hanging out with the religious people. Religious people. Oh, some of the people out in the. Yeah, the, I don't think they're re re religious. Just because he had the little star on uh, it, don't make him religious. Well, the good people. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the good people of the world, not the, the shits that he normally hangs out with. Yeah. We asked the father to judge us with mercy. We asked the mother to. Fucking, I don't remember the rest. I'm sorry you're dead. You deserve better. Mm-hmm. He got a heart. Yeah. Well, you know, when he's saying Sansa. Yeah, Sansa. I got it right that time. Well, finally. I had to think. No, no, I heard it. <laughs> heard it. Heard when the he wheels. Said, mm -hmm. When he saved her, um, that showed his human side. Yeah. You should really sleep, Sam. The dead don't. Legends of the long night. The Targaryens used dragonglass to decorate the weapons without even knowing what the first men used it for. Now that. Mm -mm. Is that? that was a knife that the dude tried to kill Bran with in season one. Oh. It's a map of Dragonstone. The Targaryens built their first stronghold there when they invaded Westeros. That's Dragonglass. A mountain of it. Beneath the ground. Stannis told me, but I didn't think it is important. Stannis. John needs to know. You talked to Stannis? Yeah, you remember when he was at the wall? Oh. They went down there and talk, talked to Sam about him killing the White Walker. Yeah. He gonna get in trouble because I bet he didn't return them keys, did he? Sorry. Mm -hmm. 
Well, I guess a maester is a nurse. Doctor. Boy, <gasps> oh, that scared me. <laughs> Has she come yet? Who? The Dragon Queen. Daenerys Stormborn. I haven't heard anything. That's what's his name. Yeah. Getting, getting bad. You look worse than in all the other ones. At least theirs right. was great. He right. was black. Uh, well. You're like, we'll go check it out for your mommy. Why she come here? Has she come yet? Oh. Yeah, he, he had dreams or something about us. I guess he's just wondering if she came to Westeros yet. And I hope they uncle die. Before he gets back to her. I mean, seriously. I mean, but shouldn't the people come before you? Uh -huh. You would think they would go, like, make sure nobody's there yeah. and protect her and stuff, but hey. She's the first one come through. Well, now y'all want to go through. <laughs> At least you got some guards. That's a long way up to the Dago mm -hmm. Castle. Mm -hmm. If anybody left there. And yet, still behind her. Hey. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not having a problem with that. <laughs> she leads the way. Mm. Yeah, she be take the queen out. It's a Stannis yeah. banner, right? So he took everybody with him when he left? Yeah, yeah. He said, because we ain't coming back here. He was for sure going to have it. Thought he's going to have that throne, huh? Mm -hmm. That's supposed to be her throne. A chair. <laughs> I guess. For there. Well. Shall we begin? Okay. Time to the begin to strategize. Yeah, so. Okay, that was a slow start. Yeah, well, the first episode of the season, yeah, like set up. So. Like, so, she's, as you see, Daenerys is finally in Westeros. Yeah. Better. Finally. And then John is doing his ruling so up in the north. Yeah, so, but that means because Dennis went from where Dragonstone is to the King's Landing. Yeah. And they got, you know, they got that wildfire. Dragonstone is not that far from King's Landing. Ooh, they going to be in trouble, trouble. Okay. It's like, it's, I don't think it's actually that far. So we're going to have to see how this going. But, Go. yeah, so Arya's. Heading to King's Landing to kill Cersei. Yeah, she was bold with it. She told him what she and they laughed at him. Yeah. I thought, you don't tell them. They're, they're the Lannister people. Yeah. But they look like they're more of a... Were, we just... They, we got shoved into this thing. They were the privates of the army. Yeah. They we just got shoved, yeah. shoved into this thing. They're the draftees. Yeah. They got drafted and they, they don't... They just want to go home. So, I'm... Um... 
So you got you got John and Sansa kind of bickering in between it back and forth. Yeah. Uh Bailey's is still up there trying to do you, know, you can look at your phone. You know. Bailey's is up there trying to do his little sneaky shit. Cersei well you, Cersei is trying to get uh the Greyjoys to help her out. So he's gonna go look for a gift, get her her gift. And I wonder what this gift gonna be. Is the gift gonna be I'm gonna get Tyrion, kill him? Is the gift gonna be I'm gonna get Sansa and he, bring her back to you? Is the gift gonna be um uh, what else? Who else she want? Oh, is the gift gonna be any of her many enemies that she has? Could oh, be any oh, of them. Oh, what's the old lady? Olena. Olen what? Olena Tyrell. Olena Tyrell is going to be her. It's going to be the Dorn people. Who? Dorn. 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 I'm not saying Dorn. Dorn people. Uh, hey, it, could be, going it could be on. any of them, to tell you the truth. But that was a slart, uh, slow. It's slow, a slow burn episode. Slow beginning. Yeah. So I'm hoping it's going to pick up season, I mean, episode two, three. Cause I'll be like, okay, this is. Well, it's got to pick slow. up. We only got seven seven episodes this season, so you. Oh, only, we do. We only got seven. <laughs> yeah, this this season's only seven, so yeah. got to pick up pretty quick. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, but the timeline, like the last time, the uncle, uh, uh, Theon's yeah. uncle, he was like, "Go get the, go get the, build the ships and stuff like that." Okay, that was two episodes ago. Yeah. Now all of a sudden, and she's still wearing black. So you that means you you well, I think she mourning you've been mourning him for all this time because No, I think I just think she's just gonna wear black from now on because I think she just said I'm I'm the evil one. I'm gonna wear black. Because well, she, she changed her King's Guard colors to black, black and silver. Yeah. So is she um is I mean, but Tom Tommen is dead because uh because uh no, because I told her to check CB. Oh, yes. I smell it. Oh, so, um, uh, Tom. You got a good nose. I don't smell nothing. Tommen is uh, dead because of her. Yeah. He committed suicide because of her. And like James said, we're not going to talk about this. All of our children are dead. She didn't want to talk about it because, I mean, like, it. Because like that was her fault. But she talked about but, Joffrey. But in and her Marcellus, mind, he betrayed her because he turned, like, because he did stuff against her. So. Yeah, well. Like, he's, I don't think she gives two flying parts that he's dead, the truth. Yeah, I don't think so that, either. It didn't look like she, she shed got, a tear over him. She didn't. I didn't see not one tear drop. But, uh. I didn't see not one tear drop. And then Sam sneaking around, breaking into the restricted section of the library. Yeah, but I can't do what he do. Oh, day oh, in, day it, out. Yes. And we saw Jorah. Jorah is at this well, there. Oh, yeah. To, I guess he went there to try to get healed. Yeah, well, so how he going to do it? I don't know. I don't know, because he looked worse than the, all, all the right. other ones I had seen. Like, well, other than the the fully turned ones. that They were great. Oh, yeah. But they went, maybe it was like they got the gray got, warm. Maybe gray it goes joy. from cracks to blacks, then to gray. Who knows? No, because it was well, it was, it was white before, right? Yeah, well, it was his flesh like, tone. Yeah, but it looked like it was like dried black up. And red. It looked like a dried up to, scab, kind of. Yeah, you kind of like, just need to be dipped in some water. Bad kill you. Let it slough off. You know how we, you know how we have, we have how we have to do it now, uh, when we debride yeah. wounds and stuff. Yeah, that's probably all he need. Debriding. Yeah, debriding. Uh, hey, maybe. I'm just saying. I mean, you know, <laughs> he's a good breeding. I'm just saying. Wound care. Yeah. Yeah, get the next wound care. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a, uh, like I said, that was a good episode. Slow start. Um, thank you guys for joining us on this journey. If this is your first time joining us, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. Give us a thumbs up and always leave your comment. Until next time. Bye bye.